What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Toledo versus Kent State college basketball matchup going down Thursday, March 14th, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between Toledo and Kent State. It is the quarterfinals of the MAC tournament. You have top seeded Toledo finishing the year 14 and 4 overall, 20 and 11, in, um, excuse me, 14 and 4 in conference play, 20 and 11 overall this season, while Kent State, the 8th seed, 8 and 10 in conference play as part of their 15 and 16 overall mark this season. And uh, these two teams met in the regular season, and it was all Toledo, you know, double digit victories by the Rockets in both meetings, winning the first one by 14 and winning the rematch, the last game of the regular season for both these teams with Toledo coming out on top at home, 86-71. And, um, you know, this just hasn't been the same Kent State team as we've seen in years past. You know, Rob Senderoff has this team, you know, normally making the tournament, or at least uh, posting up 20 win seasons. They made the NCAA tournament last season for the MAC. Um, but this year was just a lot of inconsistencies. The team could never get too high or too low. They never won or lost more than back-to-back -back games in conference play. And... Um, I said the results were like we saw on the board, a lot of inconsistencies. But the one thing that Kent State did do consistently over the course of conference play was fail to cover point spreads. Down the stretch, Kent State 0 and 6 against the number in their last six overall, 1 and 1 and 8 against the number in their last nine, and um, that's not going to cut it here. You know, Toledo. This has been a, a, a Toledo team that in the years past maybe been a little bit up and down, but you know this year Toledo finished at the top of the conference. You know, normally. Toledo had a you know a really talented roster. This was normally a team that you could fin count on to finish at the top of the standings. I would say more often than not, um, the only down year they had going back to was going back to 2020 where they went 17 and 15. But year after year under Todd Kowalczyk, this is a, a 20 plus win Toledo team. They've had 20 plus wins in six of the last seven seasons, and this year is no different. You know, I think Toledo is the better team in this matchup. They did a good job. You know covering point spreads down the stretch they finished with back-to-back -back covers to close out the year and i just think toledo is the better team in this matchup so much as I like kent state unfortunately i think this is the end of the road for him i think toledo gets the win cover completes the trifecta and moves on here i'm going to take toledo i'm going to lay the four and a half points in this one and that's going to be my pre-pick but just a reminder if you haven't already make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up and if you're looking for my best bets you can find those at pick dogs premium while you're pick dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here. Pick dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.